Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 video. In this video, we'll cover all of the masks, outfits, plans that you can get from the Fat Slash Day event. So let's start wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so the Fast Nice Day event uh, has uh, been with us twice now so far. Once we had in 2019 and one we had in 2020. So, uh, this is a time limited. I'm not sure if it's going to be in 2021, but let's hope it will. So, let's start off with uh, the masks. That's the easiest one, right? And if we go to the apparel section over here. Why I always want to say appeal? <laughs> Lol. Anyway, so let's start with the beret. This is the beret that we get. I have a whole bunch of them sta uh, saved up in the stash. So that's how it looks like. Alright, the next on the menu is the crazy guy mask. It's one of the rare masks, by the way. Also pretty hard to get. Uh, also, I wanted to thank you a couple of Z Clan members who have helped me to get my collection done. You know who you guys are. And uh, once again, big thank you. So then we got the Deathblow Mask. It's also one of the rare masks that you can get. There we go. Then we got the Giant Mask. It's a common one if I'm not mistaken. Got a whole bunch of these too. And I remember I got it back in 2019 when I used to play on PC. A lot of those. The Goblin Mask is like midish rareish, I would say. Definitely back in 2019 I didn't get this mask, but now I have it. I'm not even sure if it was available back in 2019. Although, it, it actually matches my outfit, huh? Maybe I'm gonna wear this one. It's not that big bulky and it's looking nice. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Then we got Jester. <laughs> the crazy Joker mask, huh? I'm gonna make separate video reviews for the mask that I haven't done as I already did for the five rare ones. So there we go. The Owl mask is a common one. Can get a lot of these. Once again, I have a whole bunch of them in my stash as well. The Raven mask. Now this one is one of the rare masks as well. Scar, thank you. And Scar, thank you for the Declo mask. Fear, thank you for the uh, crazy mask. <laughs> so I've given away all the duplicate masks that I have as well when I was grinding. Then we got the skull mask. Also, it's like mid rareish as well. There we go. Now that's super bulky. Also looks good with this outfit. We got the soldier mask. Also looking good with the outfit. And it's a common one. Not that su uh, like you can get a lot of these. There we go. Then we got the Sun Mask, <laughs> a mid rare. It's not one of the super rares, it's a mid rare mask. As well as Jester, by the way, I'm not sure if I mentioned it. There we go. And the Goblin one. Toothy, one of the commons ones. Got a, lo a whole bunch of these ones as well. There we go. The Winter Man Mask is one of the rare masks as well. Pretty hard to get. I got a couple of these. Gave them away already. There we go. The Witch Mask is one of the common ones as well. Got a couple of duplicates of this one. And that's it. Well, there's one more mask, but it's a power armor mask. So I got it on the uh, my XL1. Here 
we go. That's the mask over here. Unfortunately, this is not even tradable or, or, or droppable. You hear that? It was the world saying hello. Alright, so that is pretty much it with the masks. Now let's get to the camp items. Alright, so let's start with the misc structures. So in our case, we have the hanging snowflakes. So I already have them built right here. These are all of the options. So this one is the first one. As the second one, this is the third one, and this is the fourth one. So these are the ones, the four options of the hanging snowflakes and ribbons that you can get uh, from the misc structure. Uh, then on uh, the wall decor section, we have a couple of sections to take a look at. So we have this, we have that, these ones right here, uh, the Halvadia Garland, the Branch Garland, the Party Streamers. So I already built mine over here as you can see. So I'm not going to waste that budget and they're all hanging out over there. So these are the ones you can get over here too. And uh, let me just show you once again on the blank wall that we don't have anything. So then we have this section as well, also a couple of them. So mountain ribbons, one and two options. Then we got the flags, sort of uh, the orange style flag and the purplish style flag. So I have a couple of them hanging around here, as you can see in my little collection. And I believe that's it from this section. Yep. Actually, sorry, my bad. Also, you can mount the Mega Sloth mount uh, from doing this event, by the way, if you didn't notice. It's confirmed, I got a couple of these plants, and uh, you actually get this as well. <laughs> Let's go to the next section. Alright, then we got the floor decor, and the floor decor section we have uh, a lot of different uh, camp items as well. So, that includes ribbons, pole, first option, second option. Then the flagpole, first option, second option. The pole lanterns, first option, second option. That's it. Then as well, we got the confetti. That's first option, second option. Just two of them. Then we've got as well the balloons. One, two, three, and four. So all four balloons style. Then we got this uh, beer stain over here. Looks really nice. I have it one on my stand over there and a little bit with my nuclear winter trophies. So that's another one that you can get. Then uh, there is some more. One second. This is a whole. This section is so big now. We got the fire. There you go. You can see it in action over there. Let me show it to you from all sides. Got also another mask sticking out over there. Then the Mega Sloth rug. There we go. That's the rug, but let me show it to you right now. Here's the rug. I'm gonna build one more. <laughs> so that's the rug. It's massive actually. Also a pretty rare one by the way to get. Uh, from these I would say this one and this one is very rare to get them. And I believe that is it from this section. Alright and I believe that this is the final one. I hope I haven't missed out because there's a whole bunch of these uh, things that we get from this event. So this is the part of the display section where you can display right there we go I have one stand over there looks really nice with the atomic shop uh, Thanksgiving display case unfortunately I don't own the fancy bar set but it should really add on to the fancy bar set as it pretty much looks identical to that one uh, since I moved from PC to Xbox I do not own it but now I really hope it's gonna come back with a good discount 
So this is actually part from the uh, fancy bar set. Uh, here, I think I can do like that. Here, there you go. As you can see those stands, they kind of look identical. So if you have it, you can make a really nice bar now. Well, I'm going to wait for it to come with a discount plus a little bit broken atoms. So I have 55 atoms left, so there's nothing else. And I believe that is uh, pretty much it, ladies and gentlemen. I have nothing else to show from this one. Pretty much, well, I got them all. I just really hope I haven't missed anything in the video. According to the list that I got over there, I haven't. <laughs> so, Z-Clan and everybody else, you all know the drill. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave that thumbs up. I wish you happy hunting. If you're still hunting for all those uh, rewards, get them all. <laughs> And uh, you know the drill, don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed and found this video useful. And uh, if you're new and you subscribed, welcome to Z-Clan, I'm Gamer Z Sol from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. Our clan has grown to 4,621 Z-Clan members. Uh, feel free to leave your comments, just have in mind, please do not provide any uh, profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody sees those comments, nobody can reply to those comments, nor can I. And I can read them, but in order for me to respond, I need to approve them, and I don't approve such comments. So, if you want to get a reply from me or from anybody else, or from a Z Clan member, please make sure not to comment uh, profanity in your comments. All right, and uh, that is pretty much it. Once again, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, thumbs up, <laughs> and I'll see you on the next one. By the way, feel free to join our Discord if you want to play with us. Uh, Fallout 76 or other games. Uh, but also, once again, please do read the rules and follow the rules, as I do ban people for not following the rules on Discord as well. Uh, but it's very simple. Keep it pro, and that's it. Basically, don't swear, don't spam, none of that stuff. Have normal usernames, none of that F-bomb usernames, and you'll be fine. Uh, once you join Discord, read the rules, go to the Get Started section, click the Z sign to uh, get access to all of the general chats by clicking the Z sign you uh, confirm that you've read the rules and that you will not break them uh, then scroll down select the platform that you play on so it'll be easier for you to team up who's it PC Xbox PS4 whichever comes over there and select the games that you play so you get access to those chats as well uh, have in mind that is couple of days including June 1st 2020 uh, there is an issue with our uh, bot role assigner right uh, he doesn't assign the roles when you click the icons so if that happens to you uh, there is a help chat let us know what roles you would like to get and we will provide it to you it will be neither me or one of my shogun one of my mods uh, but the bot should be fixed within the next couple of hours according to uh, the technical support of that bot but anyway this is pretty much it Z clan y'all have a good hunting and everybody else I hope you will get all the goodies that you want to get and I'll see you on the next video. Adios, amigos. <laughs> Bye, everybody. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go. We are the clan, we have a gamer soul.